the like then it's time for learning more Turkish. Hope you have a pen or a pencil and a notebook or something so you could write down these notes. And if you don't, well, you better have good memory. So, yes. Let's start. Cringe. Anyway, so, first off, we start right here. This is a window which, looking at my notes, is called Penjede. I, I'm probably gonna edit that into the screen so you know exactly how you're supposed to how you're supposed to spell it. So, so here, there's the door with a nice banner on top. Um, and I will cover these off on my door. So basically, nothing you do will work until you get the correct combination. I might change it after this video so nobody breaks in. Anyway. So here's the living room, which in Turkish is called Salon. I don't I think that's pretty obvious on how you're supposed to spell it. So these are supposed to represent chairs. Which is sandalia. This is supposed to represent a table, which is masa. Yes, that's the roof. Ah, uh, here is the window again. These banners are supposed to represent um curtains, which is perde. I was told that these were like um carpets that were hung up as as curtains. Anyway, so here's my TV, which is television, which it actually serves two purposes. It's actually it's having the redstone from the combination lock. Here, this is one giant couch, which is Coltuk. Giant couch for some reason, because why not? This is supposed to be a coffee table. This coffee table, which is Sepa. Yes. Uh, this is a carpet, which is Hala. Why not? Um, next to the window is kitchen, right? Yes. Everybody in my class, I, last year, everybody in my class laughed hearing that name. So, here we, it's pretty empty. So, I decided to add a, oh god, I'm burning now. I decided to add a cool pattern since it, it's pretty empty in here, you know? So over here we have our refrigerator, which is Buzdolabe, which can also mean ice closet. Hmm? I got some stew. Well, it's rabbit stew. Okay. Let's actually eat this. Put this back in here, right there. Some cakes in there too, because why not? Oh god. Over here is our dish dishwasher, which is Bulashek Makinezi. It is the dishwasher and I'm gonna get, give me got a fork. It's a magical fork. Comes back to your hand once you use it. It's magical. Alright then. So over here this is supposed to represent this Alright. This is supposed to represent a stove, this top part, which is fitting. I forgot what oven was called. Yeah, I'm sorry. I can't remember stuff. Now, up here, these trapdoors are hidden ch oops, are hidden chests, which are supposed to be kitchen cabinets, which in Turkish, it's Mutfak Dolabe, kitchen cabinets. Heading to the bedroom, which in Turkish is Yatak Odesi. Yatak being bed, Odesi being room. Now, here is three beds, because why not? Which, as I said, Yatak is bed. Well, where am I looking? Right then. Over here, this first one is a hidden chest. Which is basically what I call bedside cabinet. I was 
called it's called a nightstand, but I call it a bedside cabinet. And which is I believe it was Comod yeah, yeah, Comodin. And this is supposed to be my my lamp. I am very, very creative as you can see. This is my lamp, which in purpose is Lamba. <laughs> Over here we have um a uh, cl closet, you know. Where just some clothes, which in Turkish it's Elbise Dolabe. Wait, no, no, wait. Yeah, yeah, Elbise Dolabe. Here we have. Wait, open. Here we have just a bunch of random clothes I got. And. Yeah. Now to close all this back up. Dang it. This is the bathroom, which is baño, similar to Spanish. Now, in here, let me actually get something. Yes. Um, this is supposed to be the toilet. Listen, I'm not really good with this, which is closet. Everybody laughed at that name. Anyway, so closet is toilet. Over here we have, uh, I don't know, a bathtub. Listen, I'm not good at building. So bathtub is kubet. And actually, real quick, I forgot to mention. Here we have some house plants over there. You see the cactus, which is called check. Um, I'd forgotten about that. So here is just general shower. Yeah. These two were supposed to be together, but I built this, and then I realized that I had to also build this. So, I'm pretty sure they're both called cuvette. I'm not sure, but I'm just going to say that. This is just a towel, which in Turkish is havlu. It's a towel. Because, why not? I didn't build a mirror, because I had no idea what I was supposed to do for a mirror. Which, mirror is aina. I had no idea what I was supposed to do for a mirror. Anyway. This is my attempt at making a sink. Which is, um, lavable. That was my attempt. And over here we have the the cloth washer, cloth washer, yeah, um, which is Chamna Sheer Makinizi. It's all brown because it got all muddy. I was out in like the forest and it started raining and it got all muddy. Listen, I don't know. I'm not good at making up stories. Now, where am I going now? Okay, this way. So this is the Chajuk. Th this first seat is supposed to have like a little squiggly line under it, which makes it sound like ch This is the Chajuk slash Gensho, oh, that's it. Which is the kid slash teen room. Oh wait, I forgot to show you something in here. Wait. I, for I forgot. I'm sorry. If we go to this corner over here. So listen here. If you want to run away from society or something. Like I'd like to do. Just go down here. And take a nice minecart, right? And I actually really like this because I find it very unique. It's also good for just hiding your base in general if you're having like a survival server or something. And I really like the way this design is. So now, send it back. Go. Okay, bye. You're not going to go very far, are you? I'm just going to take you with me. So then over here we have Batman's blocking wrenches, which we have this button to go in. It's pretty simple to sign this, but anyway, this is a nice chest. Do I have some money in here? I'm gonna go buy some like golden apples or some stuff with that. Anyways, what is this? A to-do list. So first of all, explain that you got all these diamonds from your Minecraft video. Yeah. I, I am a good Minecrafter, so I have lots of videos. I have lots of diamonds. Yes. So now you have to remember to do the house. Dang it! The house chores? Right, fine. I'll do that later. Third, with the diamonds and emeralds in the chest, pay a certain friend for the Microsoft textbook. Dang it. I was going to go spend all those. Fine. I'll pay him soon enough. Dang it. 
go back here. Let's put this micro dump for whenever we have another ride. And take the redstone out of this minecart, which will chop off my legs. But you know, I could just crawl around. It's not a big deal. In the kids' room, slash team room, whatever. I have no idea what I built here. I just built stuff. Because I was bored, so I just built this. And freaking notifications are getting really annoying. Here, just a nice chair to sit on. And here's supposed to be my computer that I'm not really good at building, which computer is Bill Gisayar. Uh, uh, and this is supposed to be like the little table, which is Talisman Masasi. Over here is a bookshelf that you could just walk on over here. And now, while we were having the lesson, in our notes, it didn't show the bed. And so our teacher told us not to worry that the, the bed was there, it just wasn't being shown. What am I stuck on? That the bed just wasn't being shown. And so, I don't remember who, but somebody in the class said that, what if it was hidden behind the bookshelf, like a secret passageway? And so, I took it to myself, and I did that. Which I'm actually going to have to remove this piece of wood right here. Yeah. And so I took it to myself, and I decided to do that. So back here, hidden, hidden away from everything. Like, if your family comes over, you want to be alone. Your little cousin's going to be able to bother you because you'll be in here. Here's your bed. Again, bed is your attack. And I just put some chest in here. Like, just in case you want to in some snacks. Or maybe a nice snack or something. I don't know that's over there. And this is literally the only way to get out. Just open this. Break this. Okay. And I put that out there. Yeah. So that's in that's all for in here, which is like this is basically the first floor, which is out cat is the first floor. Let me go to the kitchen real quick. I need to grab a snack. I'm actually gonna need a snack. Here is like the backyard, which is Bache, which it would up Jeb. That's my that's my friend Jeb. He he helped me with this farm. This is the backyard, Bache. And over here, Jeb. It would up Jeb here helps me with the farm. Surprised he hasn't eaten anything yet. It'd be quite. Anyways. Here we have just this like little water elevator I made. So let's go up real quick. And on the second floor, Ustkat top floor, just a pool. Which uh, in Turkish pool is Havus. I made a shallow and a deep end. Cause yeah, safety, you know. And I think that's technically all of it. There's this house that I made. It's really hard to go down this elevator. Yep. And yeah, I think that's basically all there is. All there is to my house so far. This was a Turkish project. It took me long to build. I made this house 42 by 42. Anyway. Jap. I think we're done with this project. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I agree, yep. And yeah, I guess I'll just end the video here and bye.